Hello Lobos and fellow New Mexicans. My name is Heather Canavan and I'm a professor at the University of New Mexico. You might be asking yourself, what exactly is hand sanitizer? And why is it suddenly so expensive? And maybe I should be using that instead of soap and water to clean my hands. The answer is if you have running water, just use that. Plain soap and water will disrupt the coating of the COVID virus just like dish soap disperses grease. If you don't have running water, then hand sanitizer is a great option. These products don't have soap in them, so they don't clean per se. But what they do have is alcohol and at really high concentrations. Alcohols such as ethanol and isopropyl alcohol are what we use in our labs in order to sterilize and disinfect our equipment. They're great at killing bacteria and a lot of other bugs. It can be really hard to get your hands on hand sanitizer right now. And even if you can, it might just be too expensive. So some people are starting to make their own using recipes online from the World Health Organization and other places. If you do make your own hand sanitizer, make sure that the alcohol you use to make it is very pure. Low purity alcohols, such as denatured alcohol, may contain up to 30% of impurities, including methanol. And methanol is just another word for wood alcohol. During the Prohibition era in the United States, people drank wood alcohol when they couldn't get their hands on legal drinks. The problem is that ingesting methanol causes blindness and death. And even if people aren't drinking methanol, it can still be a danger when it's inhaled or absorbed through the skin. And that's exactly what would happen if it's being used for hand sanitizer. On the other hand, breweries and distilleries across the United States are capable of creating hand sanitizers that are free of any methanol and other contaminants, and they have the high percentage of ethanol that you need to disinfect. For example, our group has teamed up with Broken Trail Distillery to help create hand sanitizer and distribute it around Albuquerque and surrounding areas to those who need it. Normally, UNM's motto is individuals together. Until we can be together again, stay home, stay safe, and stay away from denatured alcohol. Let's go, Lobos.